Whoa, what the hell? Why was the grave... Why was the grave... Uh, the grave or whatever. Oh, man. Why was the grave uh, a, a warp to this 1960s Star Trek looking area? Boy, I do like Star Trek. I I haven't watched the original ones. I think I watched like the first episode or two of it. I just... What I like about, I guess, I guess the whole idea of like fantasy, like futuristic stuff is that it's supposed to like convince you sort of that you're in that world or whatever. But like Star Trek Next Generation was able to do it, but you know, that was like the late 80s. That was able to, like, make me, like, s sort of... It, it was co it was realistic enough to where it was, like, convincing. It was convincing enough to where, like, ah, I don't know. Obviously, you don't ever truly forget, but it, it, it does kind of, like... You do kind of get, like, immersed in it, and you're like, Oh, wouldn't it be cool if transporters were real and stuff like that, you know? But, um, yeah, the original Star Trek is just... It's so... I mean, everything is so low-tech, it's very obvious that they're just in a room in a one-story building, probably. Like, it, it, I don't know. I wasn't able to leave my imagination at the door. It, it wasn't able... I feel like I could leave my imagination at the door pretty well, but I have to be, like, reasonably convinced that it's not fake or whatever in order for me to do that. I just couldn't... I just wasn't... It just... I wasn't convinced. Like, even their... Even their, um... Uh, their little communicator things that they have on their chest. It's just a sticker on their freaking <laughs> uniform. It's, like, super obvious. Everything... Okay, just want to make sure we had full full whip. Like, everything was just super obvious that it was um, fake. Okay. But, yeah, like I said, I watched, like, the first two episodes. I don't know. At some point, I'll probably go back and watch the rest. I'll, I'm willing to give it another shot. That was a long time ago. Jeez. Okay, hold on. Let me just concentrate for a tick. Am I even doing damage on these guys, I wonder? just want to give myself enough room where I could possibly escape. Okay, cool. I didn't need it. Uh, so I'm guessing we're on uh, the ship. Why are there no rooms? They just have hallways in this place? What kind of aliens are these? They weren't smart enough to invent, uh, like, doors and rooms and stuff? I ain't risking... Okay. Oh shit, boy, did you see that? I don't know if that's gonna show up on the capture. That that was very almost invisible. Oh, speaking of invisible, that's not quite the same. But um yeah, there's a uh, uh I went to I don't go to Reddit very often. I start going a little bit more, because there's a there's a Let's Play subreddit. And there's another one called Shower Thoughts. And I like Shower Thoughts, so I Oh damn it. Yeah, I fought one of these guys off camera, they're really freaking annoying. Oh, shoot. Uh... Let's see, watch him die in, like, one more hit. I, I don't think I ever tried my strong whip on him. So maybe I would have... Maybe I could have gotten away with not using it if I would have had, like, just done that from the beginning, but oh well. But uh, it's like shower thoughts, where you could just say, like, Hey, here's a clever observation about life that we never think about, you know? And uh, I think those are clever, you know. Or there's also, uh, they're also sometimes called, like, high thoughts. They're just, like, thoughts that you'll think about, like, while you're high. And uh, I thought of one. I thought it was clever. I said there is no such thing as almost infinite. Everything is either infinite or not infinite. Uh, like, there's no such thing as almost infinite. And I, I thought it was so clever. I thought of that on my own. So I posted it. It was, like, the first thing I'd ever posted on that one. And there was, like, other stuff on it, like, like a spider can basically, at any time, shit out a house that restocks itself with food, you know? Which is, which, yeah, that's clever, you know? But I thought mine was clever, too. And then, uh, I got, a me I got like, a, a message or whatever. They email you your responses or whatever. And it said that it, they removed it. And then, under reasons, they said it was, uh, unoriginal and, uh, and reposted. Which, I don't, I don't exactly know what that means in this sense. But they were like, apparently that one had been posted so many times that they're just like, oh, this one again? But I was like, aw, but I thought of it myself. Like, it's kind of like if you uh, if you make up a joke on your own and then later you see a stand-up comedian use that joke. You're just like, oh, I thought I was clever, which I was, but this person who's more famous than me um, got to it first and said it in front of an audience first, so he gets the credit for for inventing that joke, even though 
I guess when it comes to that, it's like you can still invent it to yourself, you know? If, if you haven't heard it before, then you can still say that you made it up, even though you just weren't the first one to make it up. Okay, I don't, I don't want to fight these guys. I'm just going to... Oh, damn it. But... I don't know why I didn't think they would shoot at me, but... Okay, no thank you. Okay, how did I not get hit right there? I don't know. Oh, damn it. That shouldn't have hit me. These dudes are so weak sauce. Oh, shoot. Uh, are we going to whip it good? Oh, man, I, I hit A and B at the same time, but I guess I used it. I thought I hit the wrong button. You son of a... He's, uh, he's just going to corner me, freaking asshole. Luckily, these stupid invisibility potions last long enough. I do want to get this guy dead, because um, if it, if it's going to make us walk on this, he's just going to keep chasing me. Man, how long is this place? Are these guys, I think these guys might be invincible to the, or invulnerable to guns. Oh, damn it. Yeah, you can only hit them when they're on the ground. No! Eh, eh, get away! I do not want to be your friend. Can I please despawn that guy? They spawn like a motherfucker. Can they please despawn? Really? Really, game? They spawned so easily. He was like... Oh, jeez. Oh, what the hell am I going to do? Should I use missiles on him? I feel like I'm going to need that for whatever it, like boss is, is coming up. Plus, I don't even know... I don't think I've ever used missiles outside of um, a boss room. So they could just all fly into the wall and not even hit him. I, I have to do it. I don't have a choice. Since you're intent on following me here, walk into those. Make... All right. Oh jeez, I like I knew they were gonna pull some BS like this. Like here, we're gonna make a guy that chases you and shoots you and wants to touch up on you. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? I don't even want to kill him because I'm gonna walk one pixel off the screen and he's gonna respawn like an asshole. Oh man, that was close. Yeah, it's not even worth it to kill those guys. You have to just go past them. Man, they can shoot me from off screen. Alright, I'm gonna be effed when we get to the boss. I can't believe how far they can shoot you. Not in the mood for your shits. I know you're all bouncing, you wanna give me a hug, but I don't like it. Okay, they don't they don't take very many hits, but you can only hit them when they're on the ground. Why the hell did I have to shoot him 80 times for to get one shot when he was on the ground? Dude. And then I have... I, and then the one that keeps getting... Do you, are you seeing this? The one that keeps getting the closest to me, I he keeps making me back up, and then that makes the other ones respawn. Fucking stupid. Okay, come on. Dude! Are you kidding me? I can't... I'm, I'm not... This is not cool, man. Wow, really? Alright, fuck all you guys. See ya. Fucking other dudes coming at me too. Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. Jeez. Yeah, this level is not... Uh, I'm not super amazingly enjoying myself. This is just a gauntlet of bullshit. Okay, anyway. Uh... Ah, I kind of wish these guys would just drop potions randomly. It's like, I don't need random drops of random shit. I don't need money. I don't need anything that they drop. All right, so might as well uh, just keep going then. All right. Uh-oh. I don't like new enemies. What are they going to do? They're going to do something. Just use a freaking thing so I don't have to... Because otherwise I'm going to walk past them and they're going to do something. Really? Really? I have a feeling just touching him hurts you, maybe. I don't know. I was about to say, maybe though they're like alien eggs that'll hatch when I walk past past them. Boy, I didn't think these guys would, like, frustrate me. I mean, after all, like, they're so dang cute. And also, how can they see where they're going? They're bouncing, like, backwards. They're looking, their eyeball is pointing forward. That's not how vision works. You don't just, uh... You, like, you can't just see what's behind your eyeball. Oh, jeez. 
This looks like some Contra shit right here. Should I save state it? I'm gonna save state it, even though I'm not sure if I'm gonna want to keep this save state. There's no point in even shooting these guys. We're just gonna keep respawning, and they're not gonna drop potions, so I don't even need to deal with their shit. What is this supposed to be? Are these, like, the bones of... of other people or something that... I don't know, it's probably just alien technology or some shit, I don't know. So, are there multiple ways to go from there? What? It's kind of cool, you can actually see the... see outer space also from the inside of the ship, kind of like in DuckTales. We're gonna play that uh, on the channel. I played that as a... as a small child. Oh uh, yeah, that game's a lot of fun. Super nostalgic, you know, the spiel. What? New freaking enemies? Come on! Have to use another potion. We need a hot dog stand on this ship, man. The enemies, like, chasing you is a thing that I'm not, like, a super big fan of. We're going back to where we came, aren't we? The fact that you don't move very fast and everything chases you just makes it, like, like, I don't know. It, it makes, every, it increases, like, the tension on, like, everything. I mean, you can lead them into TNTs. I don't know why I put that one there. You can lead them into TNTs, which is nice, I guess. But, be, but like, if you change directions, they'll follow you and then miss the TNT. And also, TNT, the, these guys can tank an entire TNT uh, thing on their, like, on its own. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. See, I stepped away from the center... And then my shots were, like, hitting on the wall. You have to stay in the center of these places. I think the sentence I said a minute ago got messed up because I got stressed, like, mid-sentence. But, oh well. Yes, thank you, I guess, for dropping these. It's not what I want, though. How long is this place? I want to get to the end of this so we can uh, end the episode. Why is it giving me keys and money? I don't need keys and money. Oh, man. This, this is very, like, intensive of the... Or, it's demanding a lot of my, like, ability to press the button a lot. Oh, man, can we be at the end? Can I fight the boss so I can die since I have one potion left? Oh, my gosh, no! This is, like, torture. Like, why would they put make you go through this much shit? Also, I totally forgot I had these. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Really? Okay. I don't know if I'm going to remember what this place looks like. Uh, we'll meet back uh, here. Uh, hopefully we'll be better uh, prepared. I'm going to try to work my way through there um, with getting hit less. Uh, just for the sake of time and progress and stuff. Um, we'll meet back at about that spot. Actually, the place with the weird floor might have had, um, more directions to go, but generally speaking, these places, I'm guessing it's, it's been sort of linear to where I'm convinced that, um, that I should have just kept going straight. There might have just been some dead end, dead end, uh, paths or whatever, or maybe no extra paths or whatever. Um, so we'll meet back there and, uh, we'll keep going to the next one. So, Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching me uh, be all stressed out and whatnot. And uh, yeah, we'll see you next time. And y'all have a great day. Bye.